Guys, I have a problem. I have a minor infestation of squash bugs. And I already sprayed uh, neem oil on, but I'm gonna go ahead and just kill the eggs and any adults I see because I'm going to fight this battle before it takes over more of my squash plants. My zucchini doesn't look so well and this one spaghetti squash looks pathetic. So I'm going to get on top of it. All right, so this morning I came out and checked again after last evening when I came out with, this, with the squash bug issue. They do look like big stink bugs. So stink bugs, squash bugs, whatever. I mean, I get what you're saying with the stink bugs. Um, but they, I do smell the neem oil that I sprayed yesterday and it didn't stop them from um, laying their eggs. Now I've been researching this for hours last night. Some people say spray the neem oil on the eggs. I did that. I also took them off. I've seen people use tape, lint rollers, everything to get them off. I honestly took my fingers and just got them off. Old Alabama Gardener says if they're not on the leaves, they can't hatch. Um, I'm hoping that's the case. Whatever. I don't have a lot of squash around here. I don't have a lot of plants, period. I have to keep everything I'm growing, so this means war. So I checked under the leaves of all of my curcubids, which would be your melons, your winter squash, your summer squash, and see that zucchini back there? I don't think it's going to make it. That zucchini looks like it's on its last leg. I've already had to tear up a spaghetti squash. That one doesn't look so hot either. So this is war. And I've also seen another method where fellers will spray water on the ground, get the stink bugs up out of the ground, get them up onto the leaves of the plant, and then take a buttload of dish soap and and then they die. But I am going to go through all out measures, whatever it takes to get rid of these squash bugs, and I will take you along the way. You may not be able to see the actual footage, but I'll at least tell you about it. So follow along if you want to know how. So guys, it's the next day. This is day three of the squash bug infestation that I've been aware of and there's a lot less eggs on here and in fact I did kill an adult I saw and it's actually looking better um, as far as the infestation goes but every day you got to come out here and look under all your squash leaves and get them off and kill any adults and the water seems to make the adults come out of the ground more um, so I really don't see too many adults uh, the, like I said, the eggs are getting less and less, so just keep on it. Just keep doing what you can do. The battle can be won organically. There's no need for seven dust or anything else like that, but if you really have to, I still think it's better to do that than, like, lose your harvest altogether, and I still think it's better that you do that than buy it from the store. So I hope you learned something from this video, and I hope you enjoyed, and wish me luck in my continued efforts with the squash bugs. And I just wanna let you know that I love you and so does Jesus. God bless.